And on that note, the second quarter is finished. The Bulls trail by nine. The Bulls involved in another game. That's been the pattern throughout the season. And again, points in the paint have been a problem. Yeah, they have, Marvin. They're going to have to do a better job defensively. They've got to contest every pass. Can't let the offense just move the ball side to side. And I would look for some defensive adjustments here in the second half. For three. Not able to hit the three. Pretty poor offensive possession there, Marv. You've got to find a better shot for one of your better shooters. The jumper is off the mark. Marv, that's a good shot if you're going for the scoring championship, but not a good one if you're trying to win a game. Nelson to the pull-up. Well, you like the hustle, Marv, the second-chance opportunity, but they just couldn't get it to go. And how things have turned. I can't believe they haven't called a timeout, Marv. That big lead has all but vanished, and this team has lost all offensive rhythm. Here's Carter. He fires from downtown. Miller is right there. Nice play. Nice fake. And the field goal. More of offensive rebounding is about quickness and anticipation. It's a terrific play there. Nelson takes to the rim. This is where clock management really becomes a factor. If they handle things correctly, they'll end up with a two-for-one. Carter, off balance. That's a wide open shot there, Mark. Excellent offensive possession. And that's the kind of look you need in a tight game like this one. Down to 20 seconds remaining in the quarter. The score is tied. Nelson on the hop. And a foul is called. Delivery to Carter. Ding takes it away. Handled by Miller. The tied at the end of the third quarter. As we head to the fourth tie ball game, it has been all offense. What are you looking for in the fourth quarter? Well, it doesn't appear, Marv, that anybody's going to make a stop here. So, you know, whichever team can stay hot, whichever team can continue to execute offensively and get high percentage shots, that's the club that's going to win the ball game. And scores! Well, you've got to give your rebounder a lane for an outlet pass, Marv. They did so there. That led to the advantage at the other end. Looks for the post. And turns it over. And again, Chicago on the run. Orlando trying to stop the run. And gets the friendly roll. Open opportunity. Off the mark. Orlando trying to get back into it. To the rim. He's got it. What a pass. Nelson pushes it up. Fires. Final minute of this fourth quarter. Chicago down by four. Yes. I like that shot there, Marv. There, there's plenty of time. There's no need to launch long three-pointers. Get a good shot, go down, make a stop. You're still right in this thing. For three. And Vince Carter, so proficient on that catch and shoot, got it off. Well, down the stretch, you want one of two things. Either get a good shot or get to the foul line. It's a good possession right there. Not able to hit the three.
Beautiful rhythm on that stroke, Marv. Now you've got to go back to the other end and make a stop. You're still in this game. The Bulls will get it back. Open opportunity. Howard able to succeed with that box out. Here come the Magic. And he coughs it up. Nice pass. Yes. This game has come down to the final seconds. The jumper is off the mark. And that will do it. The Bulls come up short. The final score is 30 to 27. As the high point man with 14 points. Marv Albert along with Steve Kerr saying so long from Celtics Arena.